Good morning, YouTubers. It is the 13th of May, 2020, 2020, 2020, and this is Lockdown Diary number 52. Um, <clears throat> I've got to go to work, as you can see. Oh, do you know what? I start these videos and go, oh, I must do this. And it goes, poof, into thin air. And then I'm like, uh, uh. Uh, and, uh, 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 I can't remember what I was going to say. It literally went, poof. I was all ready. I'm literally ready to go out the door. Ten minutes and went out the door. TVs. <clears throat> I had a quick snippet of the, uh, the comments this morning, just read through them, uh, last night's video. And, uh, it's interesting how many of you watch this on TV. So, I'm going to adjust your TV. Let's just do that about that. Well, let's do even more. Let's do even more. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. There we go. The only trouble with this, I'm having to hold myself up. Ah! Cobwebs. This is a two way, let me put this back before I injure myself or break one of your TVs. Don't blame me if I break your TV. What is uh, interesting is, and you lot don't realise this, is all these. TV's got a, it's two way, there's a little camera on there and I can see what's going on. So John Webb, do you reckon you could put some shorts on please? Because, oh, I don't want to see that again, no. Oh, John DeCock, get your feet on the floor. All right, that'll do, Daz, J, 44. It's too early in the too early in the afternoon to start drinking wine. Right, I'm going to work. Um, hey, look at that! My fingers steam that up. Anyway, enough of that. I'm going to go to work. I'll see you any second now. In a t-shirt and things to do outside. And I'm now home. Uh, it's two o'clock in the afternoon, uh, did the job, and then went to see my daughter and played with her new kitten, which was really nice. And of course, seeing my, new, my, seeing my daughter was really nice as well. Uh, and we did social distance. Whenever I go around there, I have an N95 mask that I wear, and as soon as I walk in the door, hand sanitizer, the pure, night, pure ethanol, um, just so I'm not taking anything there. Precautions always. Anyway, this won't do. In the work gear, let's get changed. There, that's better. Don't panic. Uh, <clears throat> today is my cousin's husband's birthday. And I can now reveal the t-shirt I made for him on Sunday. Because I couldn't, re couldn't reveal it because it would be like, oh, he knows what he's getting for his birthday. And I didn't want to do that. So, so any second now I'm going to show you that. Uh, also, last night I went round to my friend Fiona's, who you all, well, some of you may know as Deus Maid. She sort of is still, but was my main male detecting partner. Uh, and she gave me a load of bay leaves. Um, they're the herbally things. I also ripped a branch off because I wanted, she's going to trim it anyway, but I, she said, well, take a branch. I was like, okay, so I ripped this whose branch off this tree and shoved it in the back of the car so thanks Fiona but um, I'm also trying to get some um, some grown yeah I want to grow my own bay leaf tree so I, uh, I've planted some I'm going to show you that any second now but first of all let me show you Rob's t-shirt happy birthday Rob by the way okay you've got a t-shirt to do today is Sunday but I'm doing this for Wednesday so because this t-shirt is for my cousin's husband, who is going to be 46. Okay, let's go. 30 seconds. Whilst we're waiting for this, I'd just like to wish Rob a happy birthday. He looks like Carl Pilkington. Okay, I'm just going to pull that up. Trying not to burn my ends. Shit. I'll pull that down a bit. 
about there. There we're a little bit. Okay. Another 30 seconds on there. Okay, should be done. Let's give that a moment. Oh, I'll try not to burn my fingers. All looking good. <clears throat> and Rob is, of course, the mechanic. About there, I reckon. Looking good. Three seconds on that. And we're done. Right, just a minute, I'll show you the finished product. Okay, there we go. My 46th birthday, the one where I was locked down, 2020. And of course, on the shoulder, we have, you know, right, the, the mechanic. So there you go. Happy birthday, Rob. You catching up with me, mate. <laughs> yeah, whilst, whilst I was at my daughter's, uh, my daughter gave me some rooting gel. So I'm going to try that from now on. So, bab up. If you're watching this, thank you very much. Bab up. That's what I call it, my little bab up. Let me show you the the small cuttings I've got in the windowsill. Because uh, now I've got this rooting gel, I'm going to dip them in there, I think. Actually, I tell you what, let me read the destructions first, and then, we'll, then, we'll, then I'll show you. So here we go, look. So I've got uh, plant pot with some point composting, two or two of, okay, and apparently you get the compost nice and moist, put the twig in, the bay leaf twig, uh, you're supposed to cut the leaves as well, which I have done here, look, just cut them, cut a little bit off the leaves, which helps it apparently, and they should be in the pot, but also it needs to be in a sealed bag like this, so it keeps the moisture in and keeps, I don't know, Apparently YouTube said that. Anyway, I'm going to dip them, uh, dip the ends in the in the thingy. Sounds rude. In the gel. You don't need to see this. I'm going to do it now. Warning. <laughs> Jesus. My daughter says, "Oh, you don't smell it because it stinks." Yeah, it does. It smells like stagnant water. Jesus, can't believe that smells. There's probably a warning on there. Don't smell or your head will fall off or something like that. Anyway, there you go. I've dipped them both in rooting gel. Uh, rooting gel. I might try and take some cuttings from something else. So, but anyway, let's find something else to do the day because my incessant waffling is probably completely boring. I have made an executive decision. I am taking the wallpaper off. And I'm going to paint it. And I'm going to put a shelf up. Do you want to see it? Do you? Do you? Do you? Do you? Well, I'll show you tomorrow. Yeah, that's project for tomorrow. I've decided, I've been to B&Q and I've bought paint. One of those scrapey things. Some rollers. And some, oh, I've got paint. What else? Oh, yeah, and the board. And some board. So yeah, I'm putting shelves up there and all the little condiments will go up there. So it's finally going to be done tomorrow. All right? That'll keep you lot happy, won't it? Keep you lot whinging, especially Carl's wife. When is he going to paint that? I bet she's sat there like that, isn't she, Carl? I bet she is. When is he going to paint that? When? And when are we going to see it in the shed? When are we going to see it in the shed? You can see it in the shed now. I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you what's in the shed. And you're gonna love it. All right, you ready? Let's go look in the shed. Oh yeah. Yes, it's got to that time of day where I show you what's in the shed. So we go through the door, the window, or that ironing board looking hole. Let's go through the ironing board looking hole. It looks like someone's punched an iron, an iron through there, doesn't it? <laughs> anyway, anyway, 
stop being such a chicken and uh, take your headphones, I mean, put your headphones in and let's have a look. Let's just adjust the, uh, adjust the exposure down. Here we go. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on, we're going. We're going, here we go. Oh. <laughs> That's going on Facebook. That is definitely going on Facebook. Uh, yeah. Right, let's have a look around the garden then, are we? Because things are coming on a lot. Look at the onions. They're doing really well. Really well. The Frenchies, they're looking good. Me, uh, me runners, they're looking good. Let's come over to here. Oh, look at that. This, uh, this Sophia, this is me, what's her name? Me, um, lemon mint, that's look, looking really good. Uh, oh, we'll get to that in a minute. Coriander. Looking good. Spring onions, they're looking good. Tomatoes. I think they want more sunlight. Rocket, 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 rocket. 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 And uh, that stuff, I can't be bothered to show you. Right then. It's all looking good. Oh yes, of course, look. Some flowers coming up. Some flowers. This is an old barbecue wire frame. Stops the cats using it as a toilet. Yeah, it's all looking good. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, well, once again, it's come to the end of the day. Well, it's not, it's come to five o'clock, which is the point at which I normally babble on about something or other, and it's been one of those days, really. Um, oh, it's been one of those days where um, I had to do some work. So I didn't do much of my outdoor projects. Anyway, I hope you're well and, and staying alert and stuff like that. And if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. If you do, I might even read out any comments or give you a thumbs up. Then again, I might not. Uh, okay, bonus footage. I actually don't know what to do, as usual. Today's t-shirt, by the way, you want a t-shirt like this yeah go on facebook and search for mega donkey that's one word mega donkey designs give the page a like thumbs up uh, same thing if you want a t-shirt get in touch just give me a design that you fancy you can have a, a rude word if you want anything you want absolutely anything if you're wearing a rude word on your t-shirt it's down to you if you get in trouble it's down to you so yeah have a look also if you're on Instagram, look for Ark Turin Mega Donkey, which is the same username. I'm on there. Twitter, I'm on there. I don't post that much. And normally it's just arguing with some of the people over something silly, just to whiten them up. <laughs> That's what Twitter's for, let's face it. So anyway, I will see you tomorrow. Bye for now. <laughs>